It's Pontypool and Newbridge playing in hoops against the Springboks at Pontypool, where many famous tourists have lost. With 25,000 to cheer them on, Wales lead by a drop goal, but the South Africans are beginning to make their weight tell. Now the Springboks are pressing. Parfit kicks clear, but Sinclair intercepts and runs for the corner, and he's over to make it three points all. There's Wilf Wooler weighing up the form. It's a good hard game, but the Springboks are much heavier and hard driving. Here's a grand passing movement. Murray secures and he's over to put the South Africans ahead. The Springbok mascot looks cheerful as the second half sees the game turn in favour of the visitors. Viviers kicks a penalty and two more tries make them 15. For Pontypool from a short punt by Jack Davis, Ken Richards secures to make it 15-6 at full time. Going on to Arms Park, the Springboks take on Cardiff. It's the toughest game of their tour so far, and the full house crowd expects a home victory. Rain's making it harder for the heavy South Africans. Cardiff break away, but the run ends as a foul is given against the South Africans. Tamplin takes the kick, but just misses. Cardiff get going again, but again they're brought to a stop. And it's another penalty against the South Africans. Tamplin scores, and the roar spurs on Wales at Ninian Park. But the Springboks come back. Oxy gets the ball, and he's through to make it all square. Buchler converts, and South Africa lead 5-3. But now here's Bledwin Williams with a chance. He's over, and Cardiff leads 6-5. <laughs> Tamplin fails with the kick, but Cardiff are the first to lead the Springboks at half-time. Resuming, they're all out to go further ahead. Penalty against the South Africans. This time, Tamplin makes no mistake. The Springboks are a little desperate now to save their record. Another try has brought them to 9-8 in favour of Cardiff. The home side are fighting hard to be the first to beat them. The balls kick forward. Olopsy chases and just manages to touch down to give South Africa a narrow, hard-won victory.